Hey guys, last night we did a um, a batch of batteries that we actually tried to recondition last night, but we're gonna test them and see exactly how they came out. I'm gonna tell you how they came out. They came out zero dead, and here's the reason why. I had a team member that has been with me for about five years, and he decided just to put the batteries like we normally do, instead of dumping out the old content and putting in our high premium battery additive right here that um that we created approximately several years ago normally we do batteries between one and five years old like here's a date we're here 22 right here it's an ever start here's a 23 right here which is only one years old look here a diehard of 2022 we got a 21 right here another 23 so we got all 24. dates in here 24 normally the process is very simple we dump out the old content and we pour in a high premium battery additive, which helps delete and get all that corrosion surface off the plates. And this is what happened last night. We actually, we do batteries about 16, 20 hours overnight. So we came in, tested the batteries. This right here is only two years old. Look here guys, let's do a hydrometer. It's in the red. It's straight water. Straight water guys, straight water. This one right here, this one right here is only a year old. Look at this, it's in the red. This battery right here is manufactured January of 2023. Look, it's already in the red already, guys. This right here is only, what, January of this year. Let's see you in here, let's see. Seven months, guys, look, it's in the red. Cause you know why? Battery manufacturers are not putting a high premium battery additive in your batteries, guys. This is the reason why your battery goes dead between one to three years, guys. It's watered down stuff. And what and you put watered down solution in your batteries is going to bloom sulfation on your plates. Look, let's put a let's put a uh, load test on here. Look, this battery is only two years old. Look at this. Dead. Look at that. Dead. Die hard right here. Twenty two. Dead. Dead guys. Guys, I've been doing this about going on eight years now of reconditioned batteries, guys. I'm the world's best experts, guys. I know what I'm talking about. These batteries were here all day, so I called the team member. Hey, I asked him, listen, did you dump out these batteries last night and insert our high premium battery additive? And guess what he said? No, he did not. He apologized. So I know he didn't did not, because you know why? Because all the batteries came out dead. They came out dead. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna dump out all this old stuff, which is watered down, right? We're gonna insert our high premium battery additive into these batteries we're going to put them back on a on a on a reconditioned charge overnight about 16 about 16 18 hours and we're going to tune back in we're going to check these batteries again and then i'm going to show you exactly the results of the recondition of these batteries by adding simply our battery to add that works we're getting ready to fill these batteries just to show you that it's the same battery guys we ain't changed these batteries out when them show you Look at the same batteries. Look, 2022, 23rd, 23rd right here as well. Got a 2021 right there. Yeah, here's that 24 right here that's a year old. I told you that was dead. Look at that. It's January 2024, guys. Look at that, guys. Less than seven months, that battery was dead. These batteries right here is between one and four years old. Yep, between one and four years old, guys. So what we're going to do is... We're gonna add our high premium battery additive into these batteries. Yep. Exactly what you need is some of this liquid high premium battery additive, guys. It's gonna eat that sulfation off the plates. It's gonna bring those batteries up to a higher charge than original manufactured CCAs. Guys, these battery manufacturers, guys, they manufacture these batteries, they come already watered down, guys. They're not adding a high premium battery additive. So most of your batteries that you're already getting, they're already watered down. So that's why they're gonna last between one, one, one to three years. Half of it is water. You hardly have barely a little battery acid in, in that solution on a new battery, guys. So what we do is, guys, we created our own in-house formula, guys. We've been using this for about like seven years now. No, going on eight years eight years now guy it works guys so we decided to share it with the public 
help other people out at home or business that want to save your batteries guys one gallon does one one battery so so if you got one battery you're gonna need one gallon if you if you want to save your extend your battery life guys make sure you jump over to our website batteryguyswithaz.com or visit amazon.com we actually have a 20 percent off if you purchase multiple batteries on amazon.com as well guys so but one battery one car battery is only one gallon so if you got like a set of golf cart batteries guys you need between six to eight so if you got eight golf cart batteries you need eight gallon guys it works stop putting distilled water in your batteries all you're doing is adding water on top of water guys you need a high premium battery additive that we're currently doing and this right here is the same battery bank that my other team member did last night so what he did was he tried to do a shortcut and cheat the process of just basically throwing the batteries on the table testing the ones you know what i'm saying that, that has a possibility of reconditioning and he didn't change out the old battery solution which was watered down guys so basically just want to show you guys here is proof guys that our additive works guys we just added it to the battery simple if you got like um fork lift batteries you know those fork lift batteries runs between four to five thousand dollars even more depending on what size um gas or propane fork lift that you have guys if you want to stand out batteries in those lead acid fork lift you want to make sure you want to jump over to our website or amazon and get yourself a couple gallons of this battery additive it's going to eat that corrosion that uh, surface off the plates eat it off and gonna bring up a higher charge on your batteries any batteries that you can pop the cap that contains lead acid this is what you want to use in your batteries but guys here is the process you can see right now they empty look empty nothing in those right there look empty batteries look empty cells they are empty empty as well nothing in them because we completely drain these batteries empty 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 guys we're going to continue we got about 16 batteries right here on the table here guys we're going to continue filling these batteries up and we're going to take them through our recognition process we normally do we normally do um auto batteries between around like 16 hours overnight guys so um here's the second step that we actually just pouring in a solution very simple you can do this at home and then we're going to check back in to test the batteries and see exactly did it come up are they still dead or were we able to revive the batteries back higher than original manufacturer ccas on the label itself guys we like to show you this stuff we like to show you step by step what we do every day guys we put out videos every single day showing you exactly how we do this it's all in the battery additive it's in the solution itself guys that works without this battery additive we ain't bringing no battery back up it ain't gonna work so just want to show you guys just want to share this with you guys if you have any questions or comments leave them down below we'll get back with you guys we actually reconditioned these last night we'll give you the results and here's the product that we used our high premium battery additive guys let's see how the battery came up guys so this is that first battery i was showing you that's only look january 24 which is only like seven months old guys let's see how that one came up the original ccs on this one is 650 as you see right there, we're going to do a test on it here. 688 cold cranking amps on a battery. The original manufacturer was 650, guys. Now we're going to do a hydrometer test as well to see how the um, acid levels is as well. Right below 1300, guys. That right there is a high 10x battery additive, guys. Now let's run a low test on it as well. Bam! Look at that, guys. 12 volts originally keep in mind now this battery was completely dead before we actually added in our high premium battery additive and ran them through again through our recognition process system guys so let's move on to the next battery now we got a uh max everstart a walmart brand original ccas is 500 and this battery right here is three years old original september of 21 594 cold cranking amps on this battery right here originally was 500 594 core cranking ups guys now let's do the um hydrometer on as well let's see how good the our electrolyte seals in here as well and the green we back in business guys the last test would be is our low tester guys 
12 bolts, guys. 12 bolts, holding that 12 bolts. You know, this had to get the wires across on this load tester here, guys. Now we're gonna move on to an Everstart Marine. Original CCAs, guys, is a thousand Marine cranking up, guys. This battery right here is two years old on this battery right here, guys. So let's do a Marine cranking up on this one as well. 1,081 cold cranking up, guys, who was able to bring it up higher than the original manufacturer CCAs, guys. Of course, again, we're gonna try the second method. We're gonna use our hydrometer and test the um, electrolytes in this stuff as well. 1275, guys. So the electrolytes is reading good. Anything in the green, guys, you are doing good with your batteries after reconditioning. Look, now we're gonna put a load test on it next. Bam, look at that, guys. Holding strong at 12 bolts, guys. 12 bolts. Now, we got this um, die hard right here. Original CCAs of this one is what, 750, guys? 1022, so this battery right here is two years old, guys. 808 cold cranking amps. This is what this stuff does. It eats off the old sufflates that is blocking off the charge. 1300 on a hydrometer itself. Now let's run the load test on it. Hold it at 12 volts strong, guys. All the rest of them came out good. We just had one to come out bad, guys. So move over to another die hard here. Now the original CCAs of this one right here is 750 as well. And the manufacturer date on this one is what? This one is four years old on this one right here. Okay, I like I like these four year old batteries. Let me show you guys that this stuff is the best stuff on the market. 700 old cold cranking up guys was able to bring it back up to the same original CCAs pretty much of this four year old battery guys. The stuff, look at that guys, look at that. 12 bolts holding strong on 12 bolts guys. We got two more batteries to do guys to complete this process. Now we got another Everstart that is two, two years old of May of 22. The original CCAs on this one is 590 guys. 639 cold cranking amp guys on a battery that is two years old. 1300 guys on the Pacific Gravity itself guys on a hydrometer holding that 12 volts. Strong as on no what guys. We got one more battery that this one right here is three years old. And the original CCAs on this one is 700. 800 cold cranking amp guys on a battery that is three years old guys. We was able to bring it up higher than the original manufacturer label itself, guys. In the green, 1275, look at that. Holding that 12 bolts, guys. 12 bolts, guys. Look here, guys. If you're looking to extend your battery life, we have the best stuff on the market. I just showed you guys that exactly what we did overnight to bring these batteries back up, because originally they wasn't dumped and we didn't add our battery additives so the batteries did not come out. What you want to do is jump over to our website betterguyswithaz.com and get yourself a gallon of this right here. We offer a 20% discount and you purchase multiple gallons itself, guys. Like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel.